We're in a mission called End Around. It's a Heroes, Games, and Hobbies Escalation. Today I'm going to play against General Matt and his Zeech list. Actually, it's kind of a corn list today. He's got corn in here. No, it's, a, it's an everything list now. Obliterators, ooh, that one looks familiar. Yeah, it should. So, still got a Vindicator in there. Vindicator, and this is going to count as a Predator for this game. Oh, okay, so that's a Predator. Proxy. But this is. And what do we got out here? We got Space Loop. We got two Wolf Lords in there. One's actually Battle Leader today. The four Thunder Wolves. Uh, R-Jack and Drop Pod. Dreadnought and Drop Pod. And then I got uh, three units of Grey Hunters. The guys with R-Jack are Blood Claws, and that makes it comp out. On end around, which is Annihilation, we use the short table edges like pitch battle. Uh, this will be my long table edge. And his is on the opposite side. You're all set up, huh? Mm -hmm. So here we go. Predator, uh, rhinos with stuff. Who's got who's got the sorcerer? This is the this is the best sorcerer. Sorcerer Karn. This is Karn. This is just regular spot. Okay, no Nurgle. No Nurgle. No Nurgle. This all is right. Black Legion. Space Wolf setup. Okay, here we go. Turn one. Space Wolf deployed. So like I was saying, it's kind of a Dawson Space Wolf list. Pearl Vox casting. I uh, got two Razorbacks, they're last class. Uh, one's got a Wolf Guard in it. Wolf Guard with one with Wolf Claw, the other, the Rhino has the Power Fist guy in it. And we got four Thunder Wolves, one's Wolf Lord, one's Battle Leader. And we got uh, our Jack in the Drop Pod, and uh, with Wolf Claws, or uh, Blood Claws, and uh, Dreadnought in the Drop Pod. Then over here we got uh, Z Charmy, General Matt. And uh, let's see, we got Lash Sorcerer. He pops smoke? Yeah. Uh, Karn's I know, he's got smoke on it. We got a Vindicator in the middle, a Blitz in the middle, and another Rhino with uh, Zeech guys. They all got Zeech guys. And then uh, this Vindicator in the back is actually a Predator with Sponson. I think that's his whole army, no reserves. Right? All I've got, uh, I've got a drop pod in reserve after we decide which one comes in. So that's the game. It's called End Around. It's Kill Points. Pretty straightforward. Okay, going into the top of two. Uh, what happened on turn one? He shot at me with the uh, last cannon. And that uh, shook this guy, which is good now. And he popped smoke when he moved 12 inches. And I think that was that was it. Oh, he caused a wound on one of the Thunder Wolves. I'll put the dice back on him here in a second uh, with one of his obliterators. And then my turn, Drop Pod came in with our Jack behind this Rhino. Uh, Melta and the uh, Hammer missed. I got a one and a two, which is great. And then uh, Thunder Wolves made it in on the uh, obliterators. Wiped them out, no wounds. So that's turn two, and it's uh, Zeech Guy's turn. All right, we are going into the bottom of turn two. Uh, Chaos Guy moved forward with everything. Jumped out with these each guys over here. Took shots at the Blood Claws. Killed three. Um, he also pounded the Thunder Wolves with uh, stuff. You know, he shot at them with this Vindicator. And, well, I guess it was just the Vindicator and Karn's uh, plasma pistol. And uh, I guess he killed the uh, Thunder Wolf that way. Actually, killed two Thunder Wolves with the shooting, and then Karn jumped in there. Uh, the Thunder Wolf Lords ran away. And then Karn uh, charged into him, killed the Wolf Lord, and then the Wolf Lord Battle Leader killed Karn. So um, I think that's the game so far. This guy's can't move, can't shoot, and that's pretty much it. Nothing else is really special to talk about yet. So there we go. Roll for a drop pod coming. Okay, top of three. Space Wolves didn't have a great turn. Um, let's see here. Our Jack and his squad got over here, charged the Vindicator, destroyed its weapon. I think he can't move or shoot either. He can, doesn't matter. He can move. And then uh, Wolfguard Battle Leader got in over here, but got force weaponed. So that sucked, but that's how that goes. And then over here, I guess we didn't really do anything. Oh, I think we, we glanced this guy or something, but had a hard time hurting anything. So there you go. That's all I got. But I'm not sure what uh, what he's going to do. It's a kill point mission because uh, of the Thunder Wolves. He's up to three. So, you know, kind of worked out. Killed his obliterators, killed um, Karn, which was kind of their job. But uh, didn't get this squad over here, which I really wanted as far as the points go. So um, that's rough, man. That's what we got. And he's going to do his thing over here. Okay, going to the bottom of three. Uh, still got a drop pod to roll for. Uh, I guess this guy moved 12 inches away from Arjax's team. He didn't like getting hit with the hammer. Uh, these guys pounded on Arjax's team. I think they killed a guy. And uh, this guy got shaken and immobilized by Predator and you know, bolt to change guy. And I think that's pretty much it. Oh, these guys shot at the drop pod, didn't they? Yeah. And missed, I think. So that was the chaos turn. It wasn't really eventful, but he did keep this razor back from moving again.
All right, going into top four. Didn't really do anything on either side on turn three. Um, I guess he killed the guy on turn three and, uh, you know, mobilized my tank over here. And then I moved around a little and shot at him and missed everything. And then I failed my charge. So that was turn four. It was extreme, or turn three. It was extremely exciting. And we're going into top of four. See what, uh, see what the chaos guy's got. He doesn't have a weapon over here. And uh, that's really all. Oh, this guy's mobilized. So it's really the only things of any real note. Yeah, it's been mobilized over there. That was Karns right now. So there you go, guys. Let's see what happens. All right, going into the bottom of four. Um, I guess this is a pretty exciting chaos turn. Finally blew up the Razorback. <laughs> Got sound effects today. Uh, these guys jumped out, they lashed them way away, dropped uh, Havocs on them, killed a bunch of guys. So um, I think that's the most action we've had in like two or three turns here. Yeah. Shot at the drop pod, hit it this time, but didn't do nothing. His other bolt went off, but didn't hurt anything. Uh, Vindicator ran away somewhere, not gonna get it, probably, and then we got this predator over here. So and that's the game, not super exciting, but he's got two points on me now that he killed this uh, freeze back in this guy's turn. Killered, so we'll see. He'll probably pull it out. What turn is it? Bottom of four. Yeah, he'll probably pull it out. I don't know if I'm gonna get ahead of him on kill points. The way things are going. But anyways, that's it. Let's see what happens. Turn four, bottom four. All right, here we go. Going into top of five. Uh, four was definitely eventful. Um, what did he do? He almost murdered the squad at the bottom of four, and then uh, got my dreadnought in, who didn't do anything, of course. Uh, our Jack's still chasing after the tanks, and uh, what happened over here was I shot everything at his Rhino, blew it up finally, and then charged in there with my big squad, won the combat by four, so he's got a Sorcerer in there and a normal guy, and that's life for uh, Space Marines and Zeech, I guess. These guys failed their charge, so they're stuck out there. These guys moved over, pinged at the tank, but didn't do anything else, and that's what we got. I did get a kill point, so that's kind of cool. So it's three to four right now, top five. Uh, so we killed the uh, killed the rhino, killed the sorcerer, killed the squad inside. He killed both my drop pods at the bottom of his turn five. Uh, so two kill points there. He tried to murder this squad, went to ground, made some amazing saves, right? And then I made a leadership check. So this guy's pinned. Stand him up for fun. Got a dreadnought over here and Arjack. Z squad, Z yeah, rhino running around, a yeah. mobilized rhino, Z squad, the squad. and that's it. That's the that's the game we got going on. So right now it's kill points, six to five. Each guy's winning, and we'll see if I can do some freaking damage over here. Hopefully. Okay, going in top of six. Uh, each guy rolled for the turn, and what did I do on turn five? I killed his vindicator with a melta, just shot it and blew it up, no problem. And then over here, same thing. Assault cannon rended the front of a predator. Got a six, blew it up. So uh, that was no problem over here. It was a lot easier than I expected. And nothing over here. Just got in the rhino. These guys hit behind the rhino. This guy's unpinned. He loves you. And uh, there's the game. Let's see what he can do. He's going to tie it right here. No problem. I don't know if he can kill anything else. Uh, that's, the, that's the real question. But can I kill anything else after he kills something? Maybe the squad. Right. There we go. Pop six. All right, here we go. Uh, bottom of six. We're going into uh, top of seven. Rolled a five for the turn. So what do we do? Uh, our Jack squad actually got shot at during his uh, turn, top of six, and uh, took two casualties and ran away 12 inches, and then uh, rallied. Which you know we don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing. It wasn't a good thing for me. It might be a good thing for him. I don't. I don't think he can kill him. He might be able to. Well, he's gonna charge him too. So actually, he should be able to kill this one. He should be able to kill that squad. So there's a point, and then he should be able to kill this squad too. He might not be able to. It's going to be tough. So uh, I'm ahead by one point. It's like um, it's eight to seven, I think, or it's seven to six, one or the other. Uh, it's eight to seven, and uh, I've got a squad in here with a plasma gun. So the squad got out, popped this thing with its uh, power fist, and then we got our jack squad and a dreadnought. And that's that's what the space was. They're still rocking, but he's got his twos each squads with uh, squad leaders and a rhino. That's that's where this game has ended up. So, uh, eight kill points to seven, and it's the top of seven. Let's see what he does. So, uh, game has ended. Went through seven turns, bottom of seven. Uh, Space Wolf Army ends up with a little tiny squad inside the Rhino here. 
Um, nobody inside the Razorback. And then we have our Jack living. And that's, oh, and a Dreadnought. And that's the whole Space Wolf Army that's left on the bar board after seven turns. And then the Chaos Army has a little tiny Z squad. There's like seven or eight guys in there. And then he's got a whatever, squad leader, aspiring sorcerer, and a rhino. So it's been quite a bloodbath on the table over here. Our Jack just uh, kind of whiffed and uh, didn't kill the squadrons. Uh, Space Wolf sort of won. We end the game at eight kill points each. And uh, that was the game. So, uh, our Jack whiffed in the end. Uh, he didn't really whiff, he just didn't do it as awesome as I would have wanted. But it's a tight game, so good job, Matt. That was a good game, man.